link in the description for the non-timer version of this video. Or if you would like, you can pull up your copy of episode three of One Division and press play on it when I press play when the timer reaches zero. So, if they're doing the thing where they go forward in time as far as uh, style of sitcom, I kind of look forward to to them getting to more of the Friends, that 70s show, uh, maybe even as far as How I Met Your Mother era, to see how, they, how the shift happens. Because putting aside the cool story they're setting up, I'm interested in the commentary they're going for with the nature of sitcoms to see uh, if they have anything interesting to say about that. Recent Marvel movies, I'm actually a little saddened by this opening logo because they used to do the comic books, uh, and I thought that was so much cooler uh, than using clips from the movies. I get why, but I, I don't prefer it. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, uh. No, oh, which one would this be a parody of? It's, pro it's probably like late 60s, early 70s show. <laughs> so, uh, it's. It's like all the same characters, but it's a new updated neighborhood to reflect the new style. Or... <laughs> oh, I love this. I love this. Having a baby, lots to do. Okay. <laughs> when a man and a woman. It doesn't feel right. I wonder if the laugh track is going to be a part of anything. Paul Bettany is the joy of this show so far. The neighbor thing. Maybe home improvement? Nah, way too early for that. Yeah, because it's so discreet. What are you- what? It's like a green screen effect! Oh no, he's actually doing it.
I thought they were doing like the the uh, old school effects for a second there, but that. I swear, if she gives birth and the beekeeper dude crawls out, Wanda! Wanda! <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, right? Just creating life, no big deal. We know for sure it's a guy. <laughs> in about 10 minutes <laughs> They're actually basing it off of the ridiculous uh, sitcom logic of how quickly pregnancies come and go. Yeah, but don't hurt the baby when you're doing it so fast. Contractions? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought he was going to say, let's abandon the kid. <laughs> I was like, oh my, oh, oh my god. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, that might have been the best actual, like, unironic joke so far. I wonder if the Mind Stone is going to, like, disappear off of his head the further into this we get, the more reality starts to fall apart. I'll jump back once more. I want to make sure I catch every word, especially when it's relevant like that. Starting the timer at 8.38. At three, two, one, go.
him catching on will probably be the most palatable for her, even if it's still painful. I also like that the style changed to more of a sloppy jump cut rather than the rewind thing. <laughs> what the fuck? Hmm? That's the metaphor for water breaking. I <laughs> yes. Wow. I almost wished it was like a full com actual commercial break. Which is the only time I've ever thought that, ever, watching TV. Yeah, no kidding! Maybe a super duck. Maybe a strange one, in fact. Obviously, they're not gonna do that. Honestly, he wasn't even going that fast. <laughs> what? You're kidding me. It's not already in there, is it? Oh, wait, what's, whatever's in there is probably something reality-breaking. What's up? I can't, I'd be surprised by that too. Hello, friend pregnant. Okay. Ooh, keep that one. Yeah, right? <laughs> She's like, hey, wait a minute. <laughs> I, 
I love how half of it is just played straight. Ooh. That just looked pretty. <laughs> it didn't work, though. <laughs> This thing is officially stronger than Thanos. I hope that you, you all realize that. <laughs> you got the idea! I mean, at this point, how on earth are you going to keep it hidden? Within hours of having this kid, if... Because of their fish. <laughs> Bad. What? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> no. <laughs> She just not noticing this. I get it. <laughs> this, this is awful. In the best way possible. She's only had like 15 minutes to get ready. At the rate this is going, the kid's gonna be in its mid 30s by tomorrow. Wanda, I have come for you. I'm surprised it's not a doll. Well, now, at minimum, the doctor knows there's superpowers involved. I don't know what Geraldine's thought process is gonna be. Not that it really matters. Got like a little thing on its chest.
<laughs> Another one? Change the face. <laughs> I thought he was about to start singing for a second there. Not a doctor. Ooh. Holy moly, wait a second. Oh, this could be interesting. Starting the timer at 2038. Uh -huh. In three, two, one, go. Something wrong with that? Oh! You haven't talked about this in a while, I don't think. I hadn't even thought about that connection. That's... Ooh. Whoa. Oh, so far I like you. I hope you're not a bad guy, because that's the way that this is playing so far, even if... Upside down sword, is that a symbol of somebody? Or was that a cross? That was a cross, dumbass. It is a sword. Shield and sword.
is time about to move forward again for, for sitcom land? <laughs> the flip side. <laughs> it could have multiple meanings here. And we're calling widescreen. Is this someone getting in? Someone getting sent out. This is the real world. Okay. Answers. I don't think she's a bad guy. Nah, they're not gonna explain it yet. Okay, maybe I'd... Oh, that was hella cool. Okay. That is, yeah, 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 I already brought this up in the last episode, but it is the main thing that this is all making me think is I don't think it's just Wanda that is whatever's going on. I think someone has some level of purpose going on here. This is a really cool outro. I'm looking forward to people's supercuts of every time something went wrong in this show. I think I'm starting to love this. I already knew I liked it a bunch, but... <laughs> the fact that you, they can so e effectively change presentation formats is awesome. Though I will say that the second episode is my favorite so far. I loved the magic show set up. I think we only have three or four episodes left, if I recall correctly. So we'll probably know pretty much what's going on within the next two episodes. And wrap it up in the final. Oh, for a second, I thought it was starting some spy music. Um. 
I'm loving Elizabeth Olsen so far, but yeah, I would say that I'm enjoying Paul Bettany the most in this show, which will actually be the first time uh, that I've preferred him over her. I don't know, I think his character was a little exhausting in Civil War. And, if I recall correctly, that's... Really the last time him as a character got to take center stage with his ideals. I don't really... Re maybe I'm misremembering Infinity War and Endgame a little bit, but I don't re remember him having much to do in them. Either way, good. Next time.